Hi, my name is Faith from Hoko Host, and I'll be taking you through steps on how to connect your domain name with Hoko Host to your Shopify store. Now, to get started, you will need to log into your Shopify account and click on the settings icons. When that is done, it will bring you to this page. All you need to do is locate um, domains on the page. You click on domains it brings you to this page now because you already have a domain name with Google host you will click here connect existing domain name that brings us to this page what you do next is type the domain name you have registered with Google host in this box and then you click on next to bring us here where we'll have to verify the connection so what you do next is click on verify connection this may take a while depending on your network you just have to be patient good now we're here so we will need to add this record we can see that the current value here shows empty why for the CNAME record this is what it ought to have so now the next procedure for us now is to proceed to our client area with Oko host you click on domains now you click on the desired domain you want to register you come here click on manage domain and that brings us to Yes, that brings us to this page. You will click on Manage DNX, and that brings us here. I know something is familiar here. Yes, the C name record and the A record, which we ought to have. So we come here and copy this, the required um, value, and come to our DNX record. You want to take that off? Yes come here again and copy the IP address come here and have that there next we'll save changes the changes we made we'll save them it might take you a while to propagate sometimes Wow now we've done that this is what we have and we'll come back to this and click on verify again at this point our domain name ought to have been added to our record good so we have it here we have this here you can see that now we want to make the domain our primary domain so we come here and say this is the current domain yes we have that as our primary domain and we'll click on save yes we have that added to our account and that is it Thank you for watching. I hope this was helpful. Do have a wonderful day.